So as you may know, Rust is not the best optimized game out there. It's just in early access and it runs like crap. So if you look at my gameplay, the game runs really choppy for me. I don't know if you can see it, but it runs really really choppy. And there's a lot of stutter. Despite having high FPS, I have like 60, 80 to 90 and it runs really choppy and I, if I disable the shadows I still get high FPS but the game still runs choppy so uh, I'm going to show you how to fix that and by the way there's input lag too and that's annoying when you're in a fight or something like that so without any more talking let's begin so let me give you a quick short explanation of why the game runs really choppy despite having high FPS. Well as you may already know Rust runs on Unity Engine. But the problem is that Unity Engine doesn't allow exclusive full screen or true full screen or whatever you want to call it. Unity always runs in windowed borderless mode. And that's what Rust runs in. And there is no option from the game to make it exclusive full screen. So what we are going to do is force the game into running in high exclusive true full screen mode. And uh, we are going to do that by a launch command. So just go into Steam and your library, right click on Rust properties set launch options and at your launch options add this command window mode exclusive like you see a minus here this will disable window windowed borderless mode completely i will leave this uh, launch command into the description so you can copy paste it into your launch options so after you put the launch option in we are going to force vertical sync. Now this will uh, block the frame rate, will cap the frame rate at your monitor's refresh rate. And that is really good for a game like Rust, because the game will run a lot smoother. So I, I'm sorry AMD users, I don't know how to do this on AMD cards, I never had one, if you know how to do it, good for you. But for Nvidia users, just go into Nvidia control panel, then go to manage 3D settings, program settings, and choose Rust, whatever you want, because the settings will apply to each one of these. So I'm just going to click on Rust. And you will see vertical sync here. So just put it on on. This will block the frame rate at your monitor's refresh rate. For me it's 60. If you have a monitor with higher refresh rate, it will be higher. But anyway, it's a lot better. And this is necessary for fixing input lag and the game will run a lot and a lot smoother trust me so after you enable vertical sync that's all you got to do but there's a note and be very careful i will show you in game but when you have this launch command that forces exclusive full screen into the unity engine you can't alt tab out of the game if you press ALT and TAB while, while you are in the game, the game will crash and you need to restart your computer. So there's another alternative to browse something else wh while you are in the game and that is just press instead of ALT and TAB, ALT and ENTER. So that will make the game in windowed mode, then you just press the windows button and browse whatever you want. I'm going to show you this in the game, okay? See you inside the game. So we are back into the game. Now one step that I forgot. When you enter the game, be sure to open the console and type fps.limit0. 
so there will be no FPS limit. I mean, the game will not cap the FPS to whatever frame rate. So just type the command, and as you can see, the game runs just like butter. It's so smooth, and this helps a lot into the fights and with the shadows too it runs a lot smoother and there is no input lag at all like yeah it's it's a really really good trick so yeah thank you for watching as you can see in my top left corner the fps is kept at 60 by the way so thanks for watching i really hoped that this helped you out and uh, before I end the video, do not press Alt and Tab to browse something else outside the game. The game will crash. Instead, press Alt and Enter, and that will make the game go into windowed mode. So then you can just press search and say you want to go into Google or something. And yeah, you can go into Google, search whatever you want. Really easy, but if you press Alt Tab, the game will crash. So don't do that. And when you end the, the, the browsing, just press Alt and Enter again, and the game will go into the full screen mode again. And it runs just like butter. So again, thank you for watching, be sure to leave a like if this helped you out. And subscribe if you want to keep updated with more tips and tricks for performance on different type of games on my channel. Have a good day.